Okay, welcome back. So, Need for Speed Underground, guys. Uh, this is right now Poco F3, Snapdragon 870 at X3, 3X resolution uh, using Vulcan AP. Uh, you can see by some. Assalamu alaikum, just welcome back, welcome back. Uh, epic uh, series again on my YouTube channel, testing the Ether SX2, the fastest uh, free emulator PS2 emulator for Android devices. I uh, will be doing comparison Poco F3 versus Poco X3 Pro, Snapdragon 870 versus Snapdragon 860. I'll be using also a gamepad, GameSir X2 gamepad, and Epic PG99. All the buying links will be in the description uh, for all the stuff which I'm uh, obviously testing. In we will be testing a lot of different games, guys. Uh, I'm gonna have 20 different videos uploaded in the upcoming week, month. So please make sure to watch my uh, YouTube channel for that. Poco X3 Pro versus Poco F3 slash Redmi K40. Uh, 12 GB RAM versus 8 GB, guys. And also remember to watch this video till the end. I'll be showing you the best settings. Remember that, the best settings. Uh, anyway, uh, let's begin now. Are, are you ready? Make sure to join my Facebook group, Ether SX2 Global Version. And of course, subscribe, share, and like. Help me with the YouTube stat. Come on, do it, guys. It's very simple to do it. Let's begin. Okay, welcome back. So, Need for Speed Underground, guys. Uh, this is right now Poco F3, Snapdragon 870 at X3, 3X resolution uh, using Vulcan AP. Uh, you can see myself, it's not running full speed. Very heavy game, very beautiful game, awesome game. This is one of the best racing games ever. Anyway, I think that most of you will agree with me. I just love this Nitro game. This Nitro game is really beautiful. Uh, sorry for that, the NF, uh, NFS <laughs> and Need for Speed game. <laughs> I said Nitro, I'm not sure. Uh, so, but it's not playable, guys. For me, this 3x resolution is not playable. Very heavy res test right now for a new emulator. We're gonna go now here, jump down to 2x resolution from Vulcan AP to 2x. Check this out. Now we're gonna run at 2x resolution. Okay, now we're gonna test Vulcan at 2x resolution, guys. But remember, I uh, just to remind you that I disabled these things option down there. Okay, let's go. Two X resolution we can AP Poco F3 running full speed, but I think that occasional few FPS drops down. Let me just check it out. There you go, boom! There was an FPS drop there for sure. What a great looking game, man. <laughs> when this was released, it was just amazing, man. Us, we don't understand this now, the new kids, but probably in that time people were amazed by this graphics, bro. Let's go! Need for Speed. Underground on Poco X3 Pro and 3X resolution, guys, Vulcan AP. Of course, it can handle it as Poco F3, it's much, much more lag here. And I would recommend, by the way, it has some kind of glitch lines, which I couldn't uh, uh, fix with my upscaling hacks regarding the sprite. So I'm not going to bother it too much. Let's immediately lower it at 2x resolution, Vulcan AP. And from here, you're going to see by itself that I did activate it, this trick. Upscaling hacks align sprite. It didn't work. Check it out. Very heavy, man. This game is heavy. Poco XT Pro can't handle it full speed at 2x resolution. Check this out, guys. Insane, man. Seriously, insane. System. All fine here in graphics. We're gonna lower it right now at 1x. Let's go. So 1x is running full speed, so far what I'm seeing. 1x resolution. Can't wait to get the Gen 1 uh, chip, inshallah. Full speed, full speed. I, I don't see any big lag whatsoever or medium one. Maybe some small hiccups, but overall the game is running full speed.
Awesome. Anyway, let's show you now the settings, guys. Beautiful, one X. Okay, so for the end, we'll be showing you the settings. I use the same setting, guys. I just, um, generally the same settings. I was just a little bit, let's just say, uh, kind of tweaking the settings. And you can just pause this video. Pause this video uh, if you want to uh, use these settings with your smartphone, if you have a Poco X3 Pro or Poco F3 or some other device with the same chip or similar, uh, smart, uh, of course, processor from Snapdragon. And here we have it. Enable multi-threaded, enable. I might disable it in some games, we will see. Enable fast mem. I'm gonna also disable and enable for some game this option. You can see by yourself. So both of the phones have exactly the same settings. Graphics, GPN, uh, GPU Open GL, uh, Open GL AP, upscale, upscale, it's a 2X, which is 720p. Also, if I see that the games are running full speed and we don't see the differences, I'm gonna put it at 3X, guys. Remember that I'll be putting at 3X resolution so you can judge by yourself uh, which smartphone and what is the difference. Obviously, Poco F3 with the Snapdragon 870 should win. Uh, should win but these are the settings you can see by stuff over here just pause this video if I'm too quick I repeat again just a minute and yeah, go make sure to enable the GPU palette and preload textures you can also enable these two options down there if you want to do that and skip present duplicating frames I might enable disable this it depends of the game and we're gonna go all the way to advance okay everything else up there is default except let me just show you right now uh, here we go. Except this one, make sure to enable the upscaling hacks, align sprite. This will fix an issue of the lines over your screen, guys. And on the bottom, we have threaded presentation enabled for the Vulcan AP. That should be it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed in this video. Have a great day. Peace out.